My friends, we have a beautiful war recap. Amazing. So the breakdown, we had six Town Hall 12s, they had seven. And guys, they have a max Town Hall 12. It's crazy. I hit it. I'll show you the hit up on it that I did. Anyways, um, yeah. Breakdown was our 10v10, we had 16 for 39. They were 14 for 39. Our 11v11, we were 4 for 11. They were only 1 for 5. And 12v12, we were 2 for 9 and 1 for 6 for them. Uh, and we had some hit ups as well. We had a couple nines as well. And uh, let me just get right into it. And we're just going to hit off right from the get go doing a hit up on a Town Hall 12 maxed out. Have you ever seen this before? You know what? I'm going to make a separate video of that because that's, that's going to be a separate video. Um, let me show the let me show Daniel's hit on number four. Uh, he planned this one out. Anti three non. Uh, it's a, let's see. What, what, what is maxed out here? Let me pause this for a bit. Let's just do some. Defensive wise, let's see, a couple things, maybe, maybe some, uh, well, the storages, so it's a new town of 12, a couple heroes upgraded, uh, but the attacker, D Daniel, he has a new town of 12 as well, he hasn't even upgraded his heroes yet, interesting, I wonder why that is, Daniel, he is a town of 12, interesting that he hasn't gotten any heroes up, anyways, he's going to be coming in with, a, a <clears throat> man, my throat is killing me, kill squad, la lo. Oh, man. So you might be wondering, what are these loons for? Did he waste them all? What's going on here? Uh, he does. Oh, he does have the max loons. That's what he did. He did max loons. Nice. Beautiful stuff. Just using some loons, baby dragons, to funnel. And then he's going to plow right with the ram. We already know it's inside the ram. My guess is it's going to be a max golem. However, he could bring Valkyries here. They could get actually decent value. Um, but I bet he's got the max golem inside because he's outside of in single... He does have... No, he brought Valkyries. Look at that. Oh, wait, no. He brought a Max Golem. There it is. Okay, smart choice. I like the Max Golem there. The break may probably wouldn't have been as good, and certainly that the Max Golem was outside of range of the single. Having that Max Golem is going to really provide some tank for the Queen, and look what the Queen's able to do here. We'll pause it right there. Beautiful funnel here. Uh, made everything just work beautifully. So he could have come in from 9, sure, or, or 3. I like 3 o'clock. The reason why, I mean... The queen might snag some of the stuff at nine, you know? So bringing him at three, that would be the choice I would make as well. And the smart choice. He's got his loons in, doing some nice work. Uh, three loons, max loons, taking down one of those wizard towers. No problemo at all. He pops queen ability. What does she grab? She grabs the wizard tower. Nice. Good job, queen, getting that wizard tower. And then he's got a heal spell in the Grand Warden. So pretty much two... Two heal spells. That Grand Warren ability is like a heal. He's going to pop it right when... Oh, beautiful pop. Daniel. Thank you, Daniel. You actually... You can play... He used to be a Town Hall 9 player only. Um, but that was a nice play right there. Nice play. When I... Uh, you'll see... Well, when I make my hit-up video, I totally forgot about the giant... The, the bomb that occurred after uh, the Town Hall goes down. I was just like, I lost all of my bowlers. And you'll see that video. you want to subscribe for that. Ooh, Grand Warden taken out by a bomb. Anyways, nicely done. A lot of loons up. Those max loons causing serious trouble. Man, I, I got to like let, talk less here. My throat is killing me. I've had like a sore throat for days. Okay, Daniel, did he six pack? Wow, he sure did. So it's comparable. I mean, he does have the max loons. Uh, Defensive-wise, maybe they can't handle it. But he, he's bringing in the new Tesla. I mean, he's got the clan castle upgraded. You know, his town hall's upgraded decently. Uh, you know, it, it, you kind of need that, right? I would say it's an even attack, right? Even attack. Yes, he's got the max loons, but his heroes aren't even upgraded. So uh, definitely even, um, even attack and strategy. He's going to do the same strategy he did before. I like it. What am I going to call this? This is a really cool strike. It's like a go. It's a, it's a double. Uh, it's like a go. It's a go la lo. It's a go la lo, I guess. Yeah, go ram la lo. I mean, you got that ram. Of course, the ram is the central focus. You don't even need to bring wall breakers. It acts like a tank, and he's got the golem inside as well. I already know it's a max golem in there. Uh, oh, wait. He brought Valkyries this time. Interesting. I don't know about that, Daniel. Yeah, I would have liked to seen the max golem in there. Uh, because outside of range of the single, still would have been tanking this whole time. Queen would have gotten more. So, uh, yeah, guys, I don't know. I think, um, if, depending, uh, let me, you know, 
when do, I need to make a video. I'm going to make a video on this right now. Actually, I'll probably use Daniel as an example. Max Golem would have been better outside of range. Maybe he thought the Golem would come in. I mean, it would, but it would have still, even though it would have come in it would, uh, to the inside the range, it would have taken a little bit of time. It would have still been tanking for the queen long enough. I think she would have been able to snag a sweeper. Heck, she might have been able to swag, swag that um, or grab that uh, wizard tower as well. Definitely the Tesla. So uh, those things matter. Sure, the Valkyries did. Uh, I guess they got the queen down, but the king was already there. He would have gotten the queen down. So interesting, interesting. I do like the um, I do like the warden with the loons. Of course, he's going to pop warden right when the town hall drops. Beautifully executed. Not even going to lose any sort of activity there. He's got a heal spell in the back end. This is a beautiful attack, man. Beautiful attack. I like this strategy. Man, can I use this for... How about I... You know what? Guys, I'm going to try this next war for a Town Hall 10. I'm going to... This coming war, I'm going to see if it works for me. I like it. He doesn't bring any... All he brings is just a golem, uh, the ram, and then another golem or Valkyries, and then Heroes, and a couple Wizard, maybe a Baby Dragon to Funnel, and then he just Lalo's the back end. I actually like this. I like this a lot. I'm going to try it for Town Hall 10, and uh, we'll call it the Go Ram La Lo, or the Go La Lo Ram. What, what do y'all want to call it? I don't know. Beautiful. I should screenshot that army comp. Well, I have the video, so I don't really need to. Anyways, um, Captain Crunch, no more two tw uh, three stars on the 12s. So we'll move on to the 11s. Richard, uh, we've seen this strategy before. A uh, little kill squad action. Uh, we, My guess is there's a max golem in the ram. Um, that's just uh, pretty much standard. <laughs> he uses uh, the loons to get the funnel. We uh, Making sure that uh, his troops go where he wants them. Nice bowler bounces there on the archer tower. A little uh, building mistake there. Don't try not to do some easy bowler bounces like that. Ram just plowing through. Uh, yeah, nothing can really stop this ram. We already know there's a max golem. Uh, there should be a max golem here. This is this is better to have a max golem than the Valkyries. Uh, but we'll see what he brings in. Oh well, he does get pretty far. Oh, he does bring the he brings the Valkyries. I guess he assumed he was going to get. The, okay. I guess he assumed he was going to get in there. Actually, not a bad idea. Ah, uh, he probably thought about it more than I did. I didn't think the ram would go that far, but it got got all the way in there. So Valkyries actually weren't a bad idea. I don't know. In that circumstance, because the EA was there, the Valkyries did some work. Uh, but a golem would have been just as fine, I think. Uh, either way, I'm going to make the video. I guess, see, my, my theory is when you use Valkyries when you can get some high value for your um, Valkyries. Otherwise, you know, it, it's, there's a lot of defenses in there. Of course, the EA was there in the queen, so that's probably why he did that thinking he was going to get a trip quadruple wall break with the ram and that's pretty impressive one two three four walls i mean nothing can stop that i mean that's jump spells aren't even that good wall breakers aren't even that good so uh very nicely done he's going to swag three spells i don't even know what to say to that yeah the valkyries there actually worked hmm that's beautiful. Okay, let's see here. Moving on to Hex. And uh, we're just going to go down the list. Sorry, I know I'm not talking a lot, guys. I've got to calm the voice down. It's been hurting. We have a lot of attacks to get through. A great crazy war. They were up. They were they sh they had that extra twelve and the max twelve at that. I mean, this guy. I'll show you the base. Well, actually, you'll need to subscribe and watch my other hit up video on the twelve when I do it. It's maxed out completely. It's um, way harder than I thought. I was uh, I thought I would get more percentage, but I didn't. Those max max twelves are pretty tough. Queen walking, hex into la low, bringing wall breakers because he's got the blimp. Now, you could actually, if you wanted, you don't have to bring it. He could have brought a ram here. Where's the town hall? Where's, oh, yeah. if he, he could have bought a, bought a ram right there if he really wanted to and uh, instead of the wall breakers. He really could have. And then, you know, with that, honestly, a max golem in that ram 
would not have been a bad idea outside of range of the singles would have been you know the the queen would have locked onto it the expo i mean it would have gotten some good value there uh certainly some good value so i could see it both ways you know uh the ram can be used on all kinds of things uh, i would say definitely more value to the ram if you can uh keep her keep it alive without the singles on it does that make sense uh so uh-oh queen has to pop ability so he decides not to put a rage down and he didn't bring a freeze i guess he was not planning for that queen's gonna die mm, so close i guess he was not planning for that to happen maybe he wanted the queen to actually go a little bit for more towards nine and not towards the single so that's a little unfortunate for him but in the end it's not the biggest deal his lala was very nice and I'm not gonna I'm not gonna teach you how to do the Lalo. I'm just I'm just giving props to our guys at Spartans Legacy. They're amazing people. And the wife is texting me. Should I respond in a video? Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, texting while on a video. What will I ever do? Have y'all heard the song? Uh, y'all need to watch, listen to the, I just heard the song. It's by, it's called Wire of Love by Imagine Dragons. It's, I love it, man. I love the song. Way to go, Hex. I'm just going to give props to these guys, man. We're going to, afterwards, I'm going to show the six packers. Will I show any Town Hall 9 hits? I don't know, guys. I might show one. Town Hall 9 is pretty much, there's just so many 10s and so many 11s. This, this recap's going to be a long time. Honestly, I, I like making individual videos, but recaps will be cool i don't know recaps highlight our players as well so um yeah i had made some other individual videos earlier so i need to put the post those i'm gonna have a lot of videos coming out yeah this is a mistake guys don't ever have a bounceable air defense uh yeah this what is this base i don't know but um maybe try new meta just, or maybe this is an old meta base, base. I don't know, but seems very interesting. Okay, I like the freeze. Way to go, Hodor. He's going to freeze, so uh, the ram stays alive. Very smart. Is he going to rage up here? There goes the freeze. Nicely done. Oh, he's going to use a Grand Warden. Ram will die now. King will lock on to the... Uh, very nice warden ability right when things were getting tough so he decided to bring valkyries here interesting i mean i guess the golem would have just been i mean yeah valkyries i guess they're fine i mean if, if i think if there were more expos around um within range for the queen i think uh probably a golem would have been better but there wasn't really much defenses around there now they break through uh, and I guess the golem would have been stuck on the wall, but it, I don't know. It probably would have hopped down outside. That was a tough one. I think um, maybe it, like if if if, he, if the uh, Valkyries had to encounter all this stuff uh, and say they broke in right here, a golem would have been better in this compartment. The reason why, because it would have been tanking for uh, all those expos. You know, the Valkyries they would have just been beating on the wall. So yeah, just kind of think about that, right? What kind of what do you see? Like where you enter in. What can the golem do and vice versa and what the valkyries can do uh i think it does matter uh the reason i bring it up i think it does matter what you put in that ram uh depending on objectives what's nearby and this was a massacre golly man hodor hold the door you're a beast my excitement i have excitement it's just <clears throat> my throat i can't I need like a lozenger or something dying over here. Literally, I could die on stream. That was a dip. Sorry, Jim. Richard six packed. Of course he did. What did I do this for? Oh yeah, I failed my town all ten. Why did I fail? Was it a ninety nine percent? Or was that the war before? Oh, it was a bad fail this war. Oh yeah, and then I did a hit up. Let's see. Nice. Just using some loons to create a funnel. He's got a ram, so he's going to probably pop that. Yep, there goes the ram right now. Beautiful use of the golem and the queen right there, guys. That's just, ooh, beautiful use. Golly, Richard. You're so beautiful. 
such a beautiful German. Actually, I've never even seen your face, so you could be ugly, Richard. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, here comes... Uh, oh, Queen walks around. That's not going to help. Let's see what's in. Actually, you know what? Valkyries will be good here. I bet he's got Valkyries in there. Oh, wait. Where's, the, where's it going? Come on. Oh, no. Actually, maybe not. It's doing funny stuff. Now, oh, Valkyries... Oh, they come back in. Way to go, Richard. Yeah, beautiful. He, you know what? That's the perfect time to use Valkyries because... He, he expected his ram to go there, and it did. And there was a lot of stuff in there for them to get. The queen, there was a... Wasn't the EA in there? And some other stuff as well. Very nice, dude. Wow. Richard is just... That was just beautiful. Perfect time to use the Valkyries there than the Golem. He's going to la low. Man, queen's still alive somehow. Is he going to swag three spells again? He probably will. No, he probably won't. He's got a lot at 3 o'clock. We'll see when he pops that warden. The warden goes down now. He's trying to hold his spells, I think. He's like, I want to swag some more. But he's not going to be able to. He's going to have to um, He's gonna have to use his last spells in this section. Pretty tough over here. There goes the heal spell. Yeah, he's got to use it. He's going to put the haste down, the air defenses up, the wizard tower, just to make sure that three-star. But I could sense he was trying to save those spells. Queen's still alive somehow. Wow. Wow. Beautiful, Richard. Yeah, that's... You know what? I need to write that down. What, what, what base was that? This is base 12, and I'll show Daniel's... When Daniel... What, his, I think his second is, so base 4 or 6. Because I think the Valkyries there just weren't... weren't that, those are good comments. That's a good... That's, that's good. That's good. Okay, Agonk, or Age? Ago? Ago? Ago Inc? I don't know. I don't know, bro. But he's a new town of 11 into our squad, I believe. You know what? I need to... You know what, guys? I need to... Okay, before I... I just keep saying this. I need to figure out who's new. What is their... I'm going to do this right now. I'm going to do it right now while on stream. I Because I, I don't know the name changes. I'm going to need it for video purposes. We'll just treat him like a new player. Nice kill squad action. Wow, look at that kill squad. The value is astronomical. And he's got all his spells for the, uh, the hoggies. Queen still has ability. Nice hog usage coming in at 1 o'clock. You see those side hogs? Now they join up together. And they didn't split off there beautifully. That that's skill right there. Ooh, more hogs at twelve. Ah, uh, they didn't quite get what he wanted. He wanted to get that archer tower. Uh, now they're gonna split. Uh, won't be that won't be the biggest deal in the end. He's got one more heal spell and a skelly. He's probably gonna drop the skelly here pretty soon. There goes the skelly, trying to distract a little bit. Nicely done. And he's gonna be able to swag his last spell with like a million hogs up. I mean, these guys are just on point, bro. Unlike my voice. <clears throat> nice. Ego. Ego? Ego. Ego ink. I don't know. I don't even know. Ceramus. Wait, that's a... This is a dip. We're not going to show that. Sorry, Ceramus. He six pack dipped. Good job, bro. Reaper. Here's. Oh, this is another dip. Dang it. Samson. Another dip. Golly, man. Sam went up. Man, Sam's gone up, but I didn't go up. Maybe I should go to 11. I don't know, man. Okay, here's a 10v10. I just don't want to farm anymore in this game. I got uh, farmed out, bruh. Farmed out. What has he got going here? He's bringing in loons. What the heck were those loons for? Oh, he's trying to trigger the, <coughs> the CC. Didn't happen. 
I'm hungry. Here comes the ram. There goes the queen. Little bowler bounce onto the mortar. Nice. King. This ram will drop pretty quickly. Got a lot of defenses on it. The king's going to get it. But the ram does its job. I assume it's a max golem in here. I think uh, outside. Ooh, yeah. Max golem outside of range. I like the max golem there. Really going to provide some tank for that queen. Sure, the Valkyries could have gotten to the wall a little bit quicker. But look at this. Max Golem. Still outside of range. Now it's going to get it inside the range. But uh, it's okay. It is okay. Um, even with... Um, oh, see, it shifts off. But even with that, Queen still able to... I mean, maybe the Valkyries could have done the same thing as the Golem there. But I don't know, though. Look at that. Golem's still tanking for those two Expos and the Archer Tower. So just enabling to save the Queen ability just a little a hair longer. Maybe not been able to get that... Uh, Maybe not been able to get that sweeper without it. So, uh, you know, those things matter. I mean, that sweeper would have been killer on his Lalo section here, uh, if that makes sense. Anyways, Ryan coming in. Nice Lalo. Notice he put his cleanup down right away. That's something you got to mentally ingrain inside your head. If you don't put your cleanup down right away, most people, like newer players, they'll wait till they're like, okay, oh, the, I got this three-star, then they'll put it down. By the time you do that, you'll probably time fail. Now, maybe not every time, but you will time fail a lot of times uh, just because you got to just be in the habit. So, uh, you know, as soon as you put your hounds and loons down, just automatically, usually you have time before you have to put your haste spells down. On most, a lot of attacks, you can put your minions down. Sometimes you have to put your spells down and then you put your minions down. So it's difficult because sometimes you'll do hound loon and you need your spells right away. But usually, like when you put your after you put your spells down, you're just waiting for your loons and stuff to to work. That's when you put your minions down. So you either do it before the spells or after the spells. Uh, but you need to do it. Uh, you have to get in the habit of doing it. Otherwise, you will time fail all the time. <laughs> Great sentence there, Halo. Got time fail all the time. Get out of here, bro. I'm an idiot. What did anyone want? Big drags? I don't know. I don't even know what I want. He's coming. Ooh, nice. He's not even using a blimp or a ram. It's so, yeah, I need to start doing, I've been doing a lot of ground attacks with a post update. I need to start doing some air attacks. I don't know why I stuck with ground. I just was, I've been playing with that go ram attack a lot, trying to see what it can and can't do, the limits of it. So I've used it a lot. Probably the last like six wars, I've just used that only. I did one queen walk, um, if that makes sense. But anyways. I'm looking at my phone. Summer skirmish begins today. Nice. Fortnitesummer.com. What is this? I need to look at this. Yeah, I do play Fortnite and PUBG. I still post a lot of Clash stuff. I don't stream a lot of Clash. Um, anyways, Judo, he is definitely a new Town Hall 10. Let's see what he's got cooking. Max Hound, with that loon. He does, ooh, bringing in some, I think that was a mistake. He meant those for those to go there. Um, he will lose two loons there, unfortunately. Unless they might get a drop on. Will they get one drop on the Archer Tower? Oh, it triggers a red bomb. Okay, not not the worst. <laughs> could have been worse. There could have been no red bomb over there. Uh, bringing in uh, six o'clock loons. Maybe a little bit late. So now he's gonna. They're gonna split. Oh, they don't split. Ooh, I thought they would. He got. I was fortunate that they didn't split there. That's the danger. I guess he was on point of that. Man, this is a tough section here at 9. I mean, sorry, at 3 o'clock. Very tough section, and he's got no spells left. I'm actually surprised he got this 3-star. I guess the Hound was able to tank for all these uh, loons here at the end. So that was very nice that it happened. But Hound is still tanking. Man, this definitely came down to the wire. Look how close this is going to be, guys. Super dangerous. You know what? What I think they should do, because Town Hall 10 is getting a bit easier... I wonder if they made the bomb tower, like, you know, they have no splash damage for, um, if the bomb towers did both air and ground, that'd be a lot different, a lot harder. I wonder if they'll do that. Wow, came down to the wire. Pup's doing the work, though. Yeah, maybe, do, do y'all, th I, th I think that would be actually nice. Maybe slow down some air, you know? Because the air doesn't have anything like that. Wait, Hex. 
Well, he dipped that. Yeah, air. You know, the air doesn't have anything like like a splash damage like the bomb tower. Maybe it would too be too OP. I don't know. Maybe too much. Maybe it'd be too hard. Uh, but I don't know. That's without. That, that would be a, maybe a good idea without adding a new building. You know. For town all ten. What do y'all think? I know I'm not talking a lot, but I kind of am talking. I'm just chillaxing here, bro. Chillaxing. Let's hope I have enough space on my computer to record this video. If not, I'm going to kill somebody. Let me check my space right now because... Okay, I got enough. What is Grizz doing? This is probably Leroy. Ow. Nice queen ability. Huge value on the queen here. Gonna get the bomb tower. Does she get the enemy queen? No. Hound comes out. He's got the skelly to kill the enemy queen. Gonna be a tough kill because there's wizard towers and bomb towers. So let's see where he puts his la low. Nice use of the ra uh, blimp. They're gonna drop probably. What does he got in there? Loons or hound? He's got loons. Nice. Max loons. Doing some serious work. Get good haste spell there. Bring in some more loons at six. Very patient on the skellies. He's going to wait. Okay, bomb towers are gone, so the queen should drop here. He, she's about... There goes the skellies right now. Queen will die. She's out of here. Nice law low section from Leroy. Getting his cleanup down. And that's a massacre. Speed that one up. Fortnite Summer Skirmish. Oh, it's for pros. I see. It's too bad. <laughs> oh, it's a pro... Pro, not pro? Hmm. Let's look at that later. Back to the clash. So, Chilla, of course, we know Chilla. He was, um... You've seen a lot of his hits. He uh, did a lot of hit-ups with me in Season 3. And then season four, of course, things changed. Nice bowler bounces. Try not to try not to have that on your base design, guys. Uh, I've, I've made some base design videos. If you want to watch those videos, please do. And uh, yeah, we're just kind of give, giving some love to the Spartans players. A lot of amazing attackers here. You know, if you're looking for new meta, new attack strategies, uh, you you want to be subscribed. You want to see them in action. One of the best clans out there, and uh, some amazing attackers. Uh, we already know that. So he's probably, he might have Valkyries in here. It wouldn't be a bad idea. We'll see what he has. He has, he does have Valkyries in there. Unless I can't see a Golem. Yeah, he did bring Valkyries. Uh, Queen's going to be, she'll get a Sweeper. What else will she get? It's pretty much it. Yeah, just, she might get the other Sweeper with Ability. Let's hope she does. We'll find out here in a jiffy. Does she get it? Oh, wow, that was close. It won't matter in the end because he's coming in from nine, but uh, so again, uh, why bring a heal spell here? Notice here on the back end. Look at all the splash damage, and there's no air defenses up there as well. Uh, you need a heal spell. Uh, just more value because you got two wizard towers, a lot of archer towers on the back end. So having that heal spell would have been, it's just way better than the uh, rage spell. Uh, that's kind of when to figure out when to bring rage or heal. Kind of what the base looks like, what are your objectives. So very good spell placement for Mr. Chilla. And that's why he got a three star and that's why he's awesome. Better than all these people are just so amazing. So amazing, guys. Unbelievably amazing. Nice hit, buddy. I do have enthusiasm, just not in the voice. <laughs> Another sort of, uh, the, the same sort of strategy, it looks like. Using a... 
the small kill squad. Ow, my throat, man. Every time I swallow, it's like this excruciating pain. Really pissing me off. There goes the ram. Tanking for the queen. Man, the ram is so beautiful. He's going to freeze up. Going to try to keep that ram just alive a little bit longer so he gets that other break. He's going to have... Oh, interesting. You know what? So here, actually, bringing Valkyries would have been fine. Actually, probably... Um, it might have been better uh, because he didn't have another freeze. So in that instance, I would have liked Valkyries there. You could have, because uh, you could, you got, you would have gotten a little bit more. Um, so uh, I mean, the Golem still did its work, of course, but I felt like Valkyries probably would have been a bit better. Um, they might have done a little bit more, uh, maybe, maybe even saved Queen. Unfortunately, the, the cannon got on the queen, so she didn't have the ability inside. So maybe, you know, if she had ability there, she would have gotten probably the same value as the Valkyries, but just kind of one of those things. But uh, yeah, just kind of, I don't know. On something like that where you don't bring two freeze and he the king was a bit late, so the king wasn't able to get that down that single quick enough, uh, having Valkyries there. So 23, let me just um, put that down. That'll make a good video. I mean, sure, he still got the three star, so on the end, it didn't really matter. But I think in that instance, that would have been a good place for Valkyries, um, especially with that rage that he was going to bring in. Yeah, I think the Valkyries would have been some done some nice, nice work there. But great hit from Chilla. I need to make a separate video of this. I might. This is a nice strategy. It's called. I'll just call it the Ram La, Ram La Lo, the Ram La Lo or Ram La Balloon. Ram level, you know what? I'll write that down. 23. Let's see, we'll go on to 24 here. Barracoon, 23 is so Ram Lava Loon. And then 22, I think. This time, is this the Ram? This is the this is the Ram Lava. Okay, and 24. Sweet. Okay, I will make a video of this. The Ram Lava Loon. Because we already know what's in. He's bringing the Ram. It acts like it's like a small kill squad. More than likely, there's a golem inside or Valkyries, um, and then king and queen behind. So you're not bringing a, it's not a big kill squad. Like there's no bowlers involved. Like you know the the go ram that I do, it's a huge kill squad. This it's a small kill squad. So he brings some giants here because of the single, trying to just save his king, trying to save the ram. So his goal is to get the ram farther, the furthest he can get. So let's see where it breaks. He does another break. You know what? I bet he's got Valkyries in here. But maybe not actually now, go no, he does. He did bring Valkyries. You could have brought Golem there because there was no singles. He was able to get that down with the king uh, or the giant or one Valkyrie got it. Either way, yeah. I don't know. I mean, the Golem would have been tank, would have been getting hit. I don't know if the queen would have gotten more. The only way the queen would have gotten more is if the Golem somehow got inside the wall here and she was able to save queen ability on the cc um but i don't know if it would have done that either way it just depends golem could have gone up to the wizard tower uh so yeah i don't know i mean there i don't think it would have mattered too much golem or uh valkyries there but it's still a ram lava loon he's going to heal uh right across the expo compartment i'm pretty sure or is he going to save the heal for the back end let's see what he does with this heal spell Looks like he's going to save the heal for this back end section. Thankfully, he had loons coming in at 1 o'clock. Otherwise, that air defense would have been up. Because all you notice all these loons kind of shifted off to the... He could have actually failed. With that one... Yeah, he could have. I don't think he would have. But he got a bad split. But thankfully, he brought in some uh, extra loons here at 1 o'clock to get that air defense down. Uh, I don't know. It could have happened, man. Especially if they took the same pathing. One air defense, it could have could have been enough, but he did have a lot of loons up. I don't know, but great from Barracoon spotting that he needed some loons at one o'clock, two o'clock section. King Smithy coming in, my, using my strategy or similar to my strategy, actually a way bigger kill squad. Oh, I like this. So he maybe I should try this. He's using one golem 
And then a big kill squad with bowlers. Maybe I should do that more. We'll see what kind of see what value he gets here. Wait, this is the base I hit. And I came at this exact same entry point. He sure got a nice split with his bowlers, bro. No, he did. Well, way they went off into wait, man. I should have shown my fail on this one. Wow, big bowler value. Golly, man. Whoa. Just so much smoother than mine. So much more value. What the heck, bro? I didn't get any of that value. That is insanity, man. Same exact entry. But the bowlers just wrecked everything. Very nicely done. It's got the max golem here. Yeah, Lee, I should show my fail here. That'd be a nice this would be a nice cleanup video. Wow. Crazy. You know what? I wanna oh, I'm so tempted. Wait, sugar? New Town Hall 10. Sure. Taking down a max Town Hall 10. With a bowler, bowler Witch strategy. Now, remember, Sugar was a Town Hall. She's a town, she was a Town Hall 9 for a long time. Um, all of Season 4 and uh, 3. So, um, okay, sweet. I've got the, um, the new people here. Yoba. Oh, okay, Yoba is new. That was a, a, Ego. So Yoba is new. It's not a. It was not a name change. We have um, Hines as Bims, okay, and Warclaw is new, and Judo Tobzi, okay, and Malte. Sweet. Let's see here, and I've got uh, Antoine is new, which is Mig, Bosher, which is Die Rogers, or Die Regers, Buggy Stumpinator. Judo. Okay, sweet. Awesome. Okay, I was right. Ego is a new player. Nice hit, Sugar. Bowler Witch strategy. If you're new Town Hall 10, just try this one out. Witches are powerful. She had them upgraded. Bowlers were upgraded, too. Wait, witches for Town Hall 10, are they? What are witches for Town Are they level 3 or level 2? I think they're level 2, right? Or do they get a up? I don't even know. So FPC I Ked, he's new. He's a new Town Hall 10 to the, to the, to the clan. Let's see what he's do, using. Similar strategy to the Goran that I made a video on that I use a lot. A little bit different. More rage. It's bigger. So he's bringing in more bowlers. And a more and more rages. I'm interesting, interested here, what he's going for. He doesn't have a jump, so he's really hoping the ram will go to the town hall. So let's see if the ram can make it all the way in. I don't know though. There's going to be a lot of DPS on this ram. Let's hope the ram can break through. It looks like it will. He does the rage to try to get the ram going a little bit further. That one golem's still tanking, so the ram will break into the town hall compartment, which is huge. Sorry, the CC compartment. Now, if it wasn't able to get into the CC, uh, it would have slowed down all of his bowlers and stuff. So that's why, uh, very nicely done. He's going to use a lot of his spells on this kill squad. Holy Moses. Goodness gracious. Wow. Great bowler bounces. Unbelievable bowler bounces. Man, alive. Way to go, man. That's a cool attack. Very cool attack. He's got a rage and a heal. Maybe he was expecting to use a rage for um, one more rage on the kill squad. Uh, or maybe he just misplaced the spells. So it would have been better to have two heal spells here um, instead of that rage. You know, when you have hogs, you know, using a rage with hogs really is not any good. Let's see if they die out or survive. 
They take, 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 that, take down the archer tower, which is the only thing that can hurt the queen. So the queen looks like she's going to take down the wizard tower because they will die out. So, yeah. Little misspell. I mean, he would he would have had all his hogs up if he just had the right spells at the end. So, but he thought he was going to use three rage, I guess, for his kill squad. But still, great attack, cool attack too. Yeah, in those instances, you like, how do you find that out? Uh, I don't know. Uh, you can kind of try to predict what you will need. So you you know you'd need one at the inferno, and you'd use one more rage in the core. So. That's two rage. And then afterwards, you got to think, well, probably my bowlers will die off by then. So, but it can be hard to spot that. I'm not, it's obviously easier hindsight. But you need to try to think that, try to think that in the future. Like, uh, what do you think, you know, wh wh you know what I mean? Like, wh where, wh when do you need the rage or how many rage you might need? And then that's how many you should bring. Bosher is new. He is, Bosher, 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 is new, and I have it in front of me. Here it is. His Die Rogers. Die Regers. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet, Bosher. He is a new, new, he's new to, um, new to Spartan's Legacy. So let's see what he's got cooking up for us here. He's got, uh, who multi. Yeah, it's not multi-meta, guys. Even with the recent buff, you should still rock the singles. It's not a big enough buff. Just able to queen charge this Inferno. Easy peasy. Nice queen walk. He doesn't have any more wall breakers, so... I guess he was hoping the queen would go over here. It just didn't happen. He's going to bring in some loons, try to redirect the queen. She's not going to redirect. Interesting. I'm surprised she doesn't redirect there. If she beats on another wall, I'm going to... Okay. Uh, it won't be the end of the world. She'll get at least a wizard tower and an archer tower. She will She will be getting hit. The healer sh probably will get in range of the air defense. We'll see if he is la low. Um, unfortunately, he does. He, he has to bring it in. So pretty, pretty awesome here. He's got uh, the queen still alive um, and uh, bringing in the Lalo. So just very, very smooth attack. He put that poison down over the queen and put a rage spell, trying to hope the pups will get her. And she's almost about to drop. Uh, but a uh, nice recovery, Bosher. That was that was difficult. Queen was He did not expect the queen to go where she went. Uh, but the, the uh, enemy queen ended up dying because he had a great poison and a good rage spell. So way to think on your feet there, Bosher. Nice recovery, bro. Certainly that's something that's just um you just have to uh Yeah, you just have to uh I don't know, you have to be quick on your feet. It just takes practice to be able to recover like that and do it. Bims is new. Golly, so many town hall tens. Bims is a new player. Man, my throat. How long is this video? 43 minutes I mean, these are i'm gonna i guess town i'm not gonna be able to recap every town all 10 because there's just too many the town all 10s like the new town all nine and i never recapped all nines i always recap the tens because they were more rare but now they're not so i might have to pick and choose which ones to do going forward um he's gonna freeze the single Nice freeze while the CC was coming out. Beautifully executed Bims. New player to Spartan's Legacy. He's probably got... Let's see what he has in here. Golem or he's got a Queen. I mean Valkyries. Looks like he brought the Valkyries. So in this instance... Um, well, the, with that Rage spell, they did break through. So I guess that's the kicker, right? So you either bring a Rage or... You know, Rage Valkyries does well. But the Max Golem... It still would have been up, uh, and you would have saved a rage. So, I think if you need your spells, you can bring a golem in that instance, because and save the rage. It would have still been tanking long enough uh, that the queen would have still been able to at snag the enemy queen. So, I guess it depends what kind of spells you need in your on, on the rest of your attack. Uh, if you need the extra spells, then maybe bring that max golem. 
Um, because, you know, the Rage with the Valkyries, you don't always have to use Rage with Valkyries, but they really do well. Valkyries and Rage, yeah, powerhouse right there, bro. Um, he's got a heal spell for the back end. <clears throat> he's going to have to put it down. He was like, I want to try to swag this, but he, he, yeah, if he tried to swag, he probably would have failed without that heal spell. Nicely done. Good war, bro. Very good war on all sides. Man, these videos, who's going to watch 45 minutes worth? I don't think anyone is. Except uh, Stay Woke. This is a Bowler Witch attack. <laughs> Told you. Okay, we're gonna quadruple time this. I forget who Stay Woke is. I think I asked. Was this? I think this is Ch. Possibly. I don't know. Bowler Witch attack. We're not going to. Um, we're gonna four times it. It's an hour long video. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do something, guys. What? I'm gonna have to decide which tins to highlight and things like that because there's just too many tins these days. These tins are just. There's just too many three stars on the ten. So, Bosher comes in again. Sugar comes in again. Malte, Stormbreak. What? Golly. Okay, let's show Malte. He isn't. He didn't. And Stormbreaker. They didn't get any love. So, let's let's quadruple time the beginning. We're gonna slow it down here. Otherwise, this video would be this video would take forever. I'm gonna have to skip a couple people. Sorry, guys. Or you'll get your own special. I didn't even show my hit up. Good thing I didn't. I'm going to have to do a separate video on that. Let's see what he has in here. Valkyries. He probably has Valkyries because of the two singles. Yeah, he did bring that. No, he brought a Golem. Okay. Yeah, that Golem got melted. There were two singles on it. Um, yeah, I think here you could have brought Valkyries. I mean, they would have gotten melted too, but... I mean, Queen's still got the value. She's going to snag an Inferno, or no? She does snag one Inferno. So, I mean, hey, the Max Golem, it, I mean, it takes a long time with the two Golemites there as well. So, I don't think in that, I think in this attack it wouldn't have mattered, to be honest. My professional opinion. Uh, my throat is killing me. Malte is new. Nice heal spell. Let's see what he's got. He's got five haste for the back. He put a heal spell down already. Mm, a little dangerous. Nine o'clock looks very dangerous. He's going to have to haste up here. Does he get a good split? He does not. Oh, my gosh. Whoa. Did he have to put the heal spell down earlier? Maybe not. Heal spell on the back end would have been very nice. He lost every single one of his loons pretty much at nine o'clock. The red bombs... We're almost too much for it. Interesting. He has a hound up. How did the hound miss? Too bad the hound had got... Look, the hound has like no damage on it. That's weird. What happened? We don't have time to go back and look. Maybe he put it late or it didn't trigger any red bombs. I mean, black bombs, Sam's. I don't know. Anyways, we'll, we'll try Stormbreaker here. Let's see what kind of attack he's got. He's got a Bowler Witch, so we're going to just quadruple times. And I think we'll, we'll have to pass up on sugars. Uh, okay, let's two times it. Well, two times it. Four times it's like craziness. Nice use of the freeze. Wow. He doesn't even need a jump spell. You know, I said in, uh, I made a video. I don't think jump spells are needed in the Bowler Witch anymore. If you can, if you can guarantee your ram surviving, you don't need jump spells. And the reason I say that is because bring two freeze. Um, you know, bring two freeze if you need to freeze those, uh, two extra freeze if you need to freeze those Inferno Towers or bring a heal or something. But nice attack from Stormbreaker. And guys, should I show... Oh, wait. I skipped over Sugar. What did she do? Another Bowler Witch. Okay, you know what? I'm going to chill it there. I'm excited, guys. I just can't... Uh, Let's just go to the let's do the roar results. I want to highlight the six packers. So we had Daniel with a six pack. I'm sure he was happy. We had Richard with a six pack for elevens. We had Hex with a snow. He dipped once. He had a three pack. <laughs> um, for the town all tens. Ow, Bosher. Oh, way to go, Bosher. Nice six pack. 
Um, let's see. Anyone else? We had Chilla with a six pack. We had <clears throat> Sugar with a six pack. Way to go, girl. And we had. Oh, wait. Regal is a Town Hall 9. I don't think he's upgraded yet. I don't think so. Or maybe he is a Town Hall. He's a Town Hall 9. Sweet, guys. Anyways, there it is. There is the Roar results. It was craziness. Um, they were up on the 12s. They should have They should have won. They had an extra 12 and a max 12. And I'll show you that this base in another video. Thanks again for watching. Thank you, Spartan Legates, for the great attacks. And I'm going to have to make these videos shorter somehow because no one's going to be watching an hour-long video of a recap. We'll see you next time. Halo out. This is Sparta!